Hi guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to fix this phone. This is the Lenovo A269i, and it's basically having a problem with the boot. It's not actually turning on, or it it is stuck on the boot animation, which is or the boot logo. And even if I have the battery uh, plugging into it. Or I have already charged it will show that it is charging but the problem is even if I press the power button it is not turning on and well I can go to the recovery mode by pressing the power button and the volume up button which is uh, even if you reset wipe our data factory reset it it will not actually fix but the, the, the thing that only fix this device is to flash the stock firmware which is the link I will provide uh, the links with it which is in the description below and and let's go so before I start let me um, tell you that you'll need a computer or a laptop and just the computer just you can install the SP Flash tool or you can use Mac uh, and it works in either way so um, you must have a USB cable so you must plug this in and basically turn this turn this thing off so without further ado let's fix it So before things first, you'll need to uh, download two links in the description. There are two files. So the first file is the firmware and find the firmware which is named uh, the Lenovo A269i and just basically extract that because it's RR file. So extract it with WinRARs. So in case you did not have WinRAR, install it. It's very easy. So when you're done is instruct extracting the a Lenovo A269i folder or file just basically go to the driver and um, it is basically shown in the video and install the driver by double clicking it so there are two drivers so the second drivers driver I mean is in the different um, I mean file or a different RAR file so extract the second which is named MTK so extract that one and it contains the driver there as you can see as, it, as we try to open the driver and just basically install that and um, when you're done doing that just install anyway and exit so all you have to do when done doing installing the drivers is to go to the firmware and find the SP Flash tool. The firmware is named Lenovo A269i and SP Flash tool is found in there. So open that SP Flash tool and cl click to the scatter loading and find the scatter file. So the scatter file is found on the Lenovo A269i folder and it's on the firmware folder. So just find that on the firmware just you have so guys it's basically remove the battery here's the battery and the usb cable so just basically plug those two um at the same time so one two ready plug and it will detect on your computer so as you can see uh the red thing there it's basically detecting and um we're formatting our phone so that we can install i i mean flash the uh the stock ROM. So all you have to do is to download, uh, click download, and so guys, just basically remove the battery. Here's the battery and the USB cable. So just basically plug those two um, at the same time. So one, two, ready, plug, and it will detect on your computer. So as you can see, it detects our phone and my phone actually, and um, the 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 flashing process starts here so don't do anything on the cable and the battery just 
uh, place it safely and uh, we're almost done as you can see guys here's the device and I don't think you can see it because it's it has a bad lighting here because it's evening and I will try to turn it on like basically this press the power button and as you can see it is um, working so let's wait until it boot ups and see what we got if we did it and in the first boot up it actually will take will take time to boot up because it is actually our first boot up but just wait for that and take um, be patient so the good thing about this firmware it's actually a being rooted uh, it is pre-rooted which is actually great because you can do stuff like um, being a pro if you have rooted your device and uh, I think it is booting on as you can see right here I had a bad camera though so as you can see it's turning on right now like that it's good so to show you that it is already rooted so you can see this super SU there I don't think you can see that because I had a bad camera so keep supporting me guys uh, so that I can um, buy a new camera so the thing is it's working right now so hope you guys um, I hope guys I help you and this video works so if this video helps you guys don't forget to uh, basically give us a thumbs up and um, if you want more useful videos like this if it helps you you can subscribe to my channel to support me guys so thank you for watching and so guys the the IMEI right here is actually being Damage so that it will not detect your actually it will detect your sim card but it will not connect to it it says it has a valid IMEI which is actually bad but I have a video for that which is a universal fix and I will just provide it uh, provide the link in the description below